everybody, it's your boy C. Sams, and this is That Dragon Ball Talk. Now, we took a, about a week or two off, and game came out. Of course we did. Anyway, we're talking about Dragon Ball Z stuff. Now, there was something that I looked at and something I was researching, and it's all about the auras. Now, as we look at DBZ and over the transformation of DBZ, we see different auras. We see white auras whenever they're fighting. We see the yellow aura when they turn Super Saiyan. We've even seen the red fiery type of aura when they turn Super Saiyan God. And even when they turn Super Saiyan Blue, they got a blue aura. Now, there's something that we're not talking about. We're talking about the green aura of Broly. Now, Broly exhibits a green aura. I believe that the green aura is the most purest aura that the Dragon Ball Super Saiyans or Saiyan race actually exhibits. And I'm going to show you right now. When we look at a Saiyan turning into a great Ozaru, we see like a green aura around them. We see this green aura pulsating, the eyes turn white, and all that stuff. In Dragon Ball Super Broly, we talk about and they even mention that Broly takes the power of the Ozaru and compresses it into himself. Now, we actually see Vegeta exhibit this same aura when he transforms for the first time. If you look at when he transforms into a Super Saiyan, when you look at when he transforms into a Super Saiyan Blue, there is a hint of a green aura that comes out of Vegeta. Now, Goku doesn't necessarily have this, which is kind of weird, but I believe that there is a reason for this. And the reason that I have for this is basically, Vegeta is a natural Super Saiyan. He's a natural Saiyan. He's royal Saiyan blood. So because he's royal Saiyan blood, he can easily transform into the same type of power level that Broly can. However, he decides to go a different route. Broly is a prodigy. He's something totally different. He's a different monster. But when you think about Vegeta having that same green aura, I believe this is the purest aura that the Super Saiyan race can actually produce and I believe that we're gonna see more of that in the upcoming series of Dragon Ball Super once again think about it let me know what you think comment below like share and subscribe click the notification button so you can know we drop new stuff once again this is that Dragon Ball talk Sam's out